Could you tell the committee who made the recommendations to place on the list of U.S. attorneys to be fired each of the nine U.S. attorneys who were in fact terminated last year? Um, Mr. Connors, let me um, just say that in relation to um, Todd Graves, who I believe you're, you're considering as the ninth, my recollection on that is slightly, um, I have slightly conflicting testimony or memories. So I'd prefer to leave him out of most of what I talk about today if I could just. You're going to be talking about the eight. Right, right. All right. I'm happy to tell you what I remember about Mr. Graves, but in my mind I have slightly conflicting memories of what happened there. So uh, for purposes of the testimony, I'd prefer to reference the eight. Um, in terms of those eight, um, I know that Mr. Sampson compiled the list, and I know that he told me that at different times he talked to different people about it. He never told me exactly who recommended which name and at what time they did that. Mm -hmm. um, and that's so from your point of view, your answer to the question would be Kyle Sampson. I mean, Mr. Sampson compiled the list. I know that he did speak to the Deputy Attorney General about it, and I know that he presented it to the Attorney General. Mm -hmm. and, and the Attorney General uh, being uh, Mr. Alberto Gonzalez. Yes, sir. Now, um, let's, let's just take one example, uh, the one that is so paramount here. David Iglesias, who was not put on the list to be fired until November 2006, according to our records. Who put his name on the list, ma'am? I don't under I don't know. Uh, um, it, well, who who would you recommend a committee just seeking the the facts in this matter? Who who would you recommend to answer that question? I think Mr. Sampson's the only person who can tell you at what point he put that name on the list. Mm -hmm. I can tell you that before I left the department, um, because there were questions about Mr. Iglesias, we had a, a staff meeting, and um, I believe the Attorney General and the Deputy Attorney General were in the room, as well as a number of those of us that had been involved in this process. Um, the the I, Deputy Attorney General and the Attorney General. Right. Yes, it was sir. toward the end of my time. And I said, um, I asked the question at that point, I still don't know how Mr. Iglesias got on the list. And someone in the room just said, that's been addressed. And that was all they said. So I didn't get from that answer an, mm. an answer that I could provide to the committee. Do you know who it was that gave that answer? I don't remember.